If you're trying to save money shopping for clothes but still want quality, check out your local thrift store. There are a few tips to thrift store shopping. Madison Magazine's Shana Miller took us to the Hospice Care Thrift Store in Madison. So what's the idea of this store? This is the hospice care thrift store, and um, all the proceeds go to hospice care, which is great. Um, so not only can you find really affordable, nice items, but the proceeds go to a good cause. So how, so, do, you, how do you shop in a store like this? Well, a lot of people find it overwhelming. Um, so what I tend to do is just start kind of browsing through the racks. If there's a pattern that catches my eye, I'll take the item, look at it. If I like it, try it on. If not, um, Actually, I found two really great items here just being here five minutes. Um, this one actually is a sweater dress, which would work really well belted. Um, That's pretty. The That's other beautiful. thing that some people might not recognize is that you can do alterations on items and um, totally change the look. So, And I've done that before where, let's say, I don't want this to be that long. Let's shorten it, mm -hmm. something like that. This is an excellent quality. It's a great color. It's a statement piece, and it's in really good shape. Yeah. And, so, this, and these are all pieces that people donate. They donate here, yep. And the prices are great. I mean, I think this one is, this one's 25 so wow. probably wow. In a retail store, a this would be, that. oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and it's brand name. Beautiful. Yeah. So, um, I mean, St. John is. That's good stuff. Qu quite a, yeah, <laughs> quite a brand name. So, well, and then I saw is, this one. This one's really beautiful. fun. Um, definitely a statement color but look again look at what great of shape it's in and this is just found on the racks here and um this is a donna morgan piece it's 10.99 <laughs> it's wow. pretty shocking yeah. I've, I've found a lot of things here that i like um a lot of people ask me what are your tips and tricks for consignment and thrift shopping one of the things i always recommend again is the alterations thing is if you like a piece enough and it's a great price and you're willing to pay for the alterations a lot of times it's worth it mm -hmm. Um, you know, hemming a pant, maybe you bought the pants for $10, hemming them's $20, it's still a pair of pants for $30. When so people great have deal. preconceived notions sometimes, they hear thrift store and they think used, low quality, and that nothing could be further from right. the truth. Yes, agreed. Um, a lot of times, some of the items that you can find are definitely maybe not your taste or a little older for your taste or things like that, but there are so many stunning things like this that you can find. I mean, I was just here... Maybe a month and a half ago, I got a faux mink coat for $20, and that's all the rage right now in fashion is the faux fur and the Nordic ski accents, so you can really find some great things that are in style. $15? Yes, for this red wool jacket. Um, again, these are just things that you can find these treasures just trolling along the racks. Um, I've, like I said, I've found plenty of things here, but look how stunning this is. It's quite a showstopper. Not very many people wear red coats, and um, it's made in Italy, we noticed, yes, too. It's a so del olio. It's, it's a little worn, but yeah. that's what you expect. You know, minor alterations right. for 15 bucks. What do you want? Yeah. Right. That's gorgeous. Every girl loves jewelry, right? So um, I saw this piece. I thought this was really stunning. Um, nice, substantial, heavyweight chain bracelet. Um, you can find something like that for $150 on a high-end shopping website. So and, and with a similar much? look. Um, here it's $2.99. <laughs> yeah. Like that. My other big piece of advice too is um, always if you don't find something that day, stop back in two weeks later. If you don't find something that day, it doesn't mean that they're not going to get a great treasure. Because the in inventory always changes. Yeah. Exactly. And Shayna recently went through her own closet. And all of the things that she brought, she bought at thrift stores. Shayna Miller is here with us now. Hi there. Hello. Hi, that I'm was thrifty. fun. That was very yeah, fun. That was fun. And, and you actually got that jacket. The, red, you the red wool coat, right, that was hanging on the yep. hook. I bought it. It's yeah, an, and it was such a great deal, and it was a stunning color. So a, as we can tell, we found some great things just being there, taping that segment not very long. Yeah. And the clothes behind you, you button you got there? These are all good examples of things that I've bought before. There's the faux... A um, mink coat that I spoke about in the segment, sheath dress, polka dot cardigan, uh, long sweater, and then this this lovely orange sweater. And then I actually did end up buying the bracelet that we talked about <laughs> in this is. segment. There actually, is. these are both from the hospice care thrift store. But the the main thing I tell people that we talked about this in the segment, but thrift store shopping sometimes gets a bad name. And and granted, there are a lot of items that um, may be less than desirable to people at thrift stores, but there's also a lot of treasures that can be found. And, and if you're willing and you want to want a kind piece and you want to save money, it's, it's definitely the way to go. I think with the economy still not necessarily on the up and up, 
yet, mm -hmm. it's also a stunning way to find a one-of-a-kind piece at a great price. And, and keep going back because people donate stuff all the time and new stuff goes out. They do. And this jewelry is all from... These are all stuff. examples of other items that I've bought. <laughs> Maybe I this? have a problem. I don't know. But <laughs> these are all... And, you know, I still have some more at home, too. I didn't want to get too crazy here, but so these are definitely, again, all pieces, this, this clutch, $10. You really? have to invest a little bit of time at a thrift store. You have to do some digging, but you're helping a good cause at the same time, so it's win-win. Yep. yep, and there is also a hospice care thrift store on the east side as well, so depending on your location, there's definitely ways that we can all we can all find one. All right, you can go to the current issue of Madison Magazine. Shana writes all about shopping at thrift stores. Thanks for being with us. Thank you. Thanks, Shana. Happy New Year. A refreshing